Hello and welcome to wireless communication lecture series. In this video, I am going to explain you about third type of example in cellular system. So here, cellular system has 32 cell and each cell has 1.6 kilometer radius. So we have 32 number of cells and the radius of one cell is given as 1.6 kilometer and system reuse factor of 7 that is cluster size is given capital N is 7. The system is to support 336 traffic channel in total. So total number of traffic channel is uh, 336. We have to determine the total geographical area covered. So that is very easy. The area of one cell multiply by total number of cell. So we have to find out first area of one cell and then we will answer this question total geographical area covered. The number of traffic channel per cell. So here we, it is given that system is supporting 336 traffic channel. So we have to find out per cell. So that is again easy and total number of simultaneous cells supported by the this system. So uh, that we will find out in the end. So let's start with first information given is that n is equal to 7, radius is 1.6 kilometer given. We know that area of hexagon cell is given by 3 into square root of 3 r square by 2. This r is a radius of cell. So we can write 3 by 2 is 1.5. So 1.5 r square into square root of 3. Put r is equal to 1.6 and if you will solve, you will have the 6.6510 kilometer square area of hexagonal cell. So this is for one cell. Now in our system, we have total 32 number of cells. So for that, total geographical area covered equal to area of one cell multiplied by number of cell. So therefore 6.6510 multiplied by 32 and it will give a information that total geographical area covered is 212.83 kilometer square. Next we have to find out the total number of channel per cell. So it is very easy. We have a number of channel traffic channel that is available is 336 divided by the cluster size. So 336 divided by 7 is 48 channel per cell. In the end, we have to find out the total capacity also. So which means what total number of channel that we have multiply by total number of cells. So in a one cell, we have 48 channel and we have such a 32 number of cells. So 48 multiply by 32. This will give us a total capacity of the cellular system that is 1536 channels. So this is how you can solve this kind of example. I hope this information is helpful to you. Please give your feedback in the comment and don't forget to subscribe this channel. Thank you so much for watching this video.